Six and zero versus ten and zero. Two of the toughest amateurs in the Midwest. Absolutely. We get to watch them fight for the City Fighting Alliance. I'm curious to see, I would assume we will see both guys um, fighting as professionals with KCFA and other organizations. So it'll be interesting to see what this bout outcome comes to and, and these guys ladies features. and gentlemen this next bout is presented by body armor sports drink providing essential hydration before during and after activity or anytime you need hydration throughout the day this next bout is for the kcfa lightweight amateur championship Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Garrett Armfield. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, David Onama. Here is Mike England. The featherweight title on the line. Well, I gave you instruction dressing room. Any questions? Any questions? This is a title fight. You guys understand that? So we do have knees to the head. You guys understand Ooh. That? All right, make knees sure to the head know. allowed in this title fight per Mike England. I think I saw David Three rounds for the lightweight title. I think I just saw David Onama's eyes light up yeah. when he heard knees to yeah. the head. Here we go. Amateur main event. Big overhand from Onama scores early. Double jab from Garrett looks to fall about five inches short. Out hard outside leg kick and a double jab moving forward. Garrett closes the gap well, presses Onama on the fence. Big <laughs> punch on the break. Tons of quickness in this fight early on. Good. He's finding a home for that right hand. Here's Onama. I love that Armfield's doubling up on that jab. Yeah, Armfield, I like Armfield's stance as well. He does a good job with his hands, keeps him real high, and he's throwing really safe, simple punches. Jab, jab, moving forward, moving his head. Jab, jab, I like what he's doing. Body kick from Armfield. Boom, and big exchanges. Good exchange. Big head kick from Anama followed by an overhand right. Neither fighter has landed anything too clean yet. Everything is grazed, everything's blocked with some forms, but they are both throwing heavy. Hard Good outside, outside kick. kick. Another one. Oh, Anama moving forward with big punches. Here's the knees we were talking about. Yep. Woo. Both, both fighters move to a southpaw stance and it and it showed. You know, that's one thing that a lot of early fighters do that it's one thing to be able to go offensive from both stances, but being defenses in both stances. Oh, good head kick. Huge head kick from Onama. That was saved by a forearm. That will break a forearm if not careful. And his forearm is swelling up. But like I was saying earlier, you know, switching your stances is great moving offensively because that's how we drill. But going live defensively, it's a whole different ball game. And as you saw there, he went right back to orthodox really fast. And those body kicks are adding up. Garrett answers with a big straight right. Thirty seconds left here in our first round. This fight has definitely lived up to the hype. Hard leg kick from Garrett. Those leg kicks are adding up on Anama. Those do not feel good. Some very good head kick from Armfield. Head kick Great exchanges. Through. Boom and a hard kick. Both fighters landing big kicks here. Man, what a scrap. As round one comes to a close. You can guarantee both fighters will be sore tomorrow. Yes. Big physical first round.
Again, this is our last amateur bout of the evening for the featherweight title. Notice a title fight has both ring girls in the ring. And as the late, great Justin Ozone Orndorff would say, <laughs> Shout out to Ozone if you're listening out there. We love and miss you. We've kind of watched this card build from uh, you know, guys making their debut early on in the car to, to some really grizzled veteran amateurs here. And we've watched the level of skill uh, start to, to uh, kind of follow that trend. And we're watching two guys who will be pro very quickly definitely. Um, yeah. after this fight. And it's definitely shown in the skills uh, inside the cage. Absolutely. We're, you know, regardless of the outcome tonight, we'll definitely see both guys moving on in the ranks um, into their pro careers. And I would imagine both being successful. Both guys are tough here. Absolutely. As we start round two. I think that was a slip, was I'm a not slip. exactly sure. Yeah, it looked like a slip there. Good head kick from Armfield. Man, this is a scrap. Yeah, both guys staying right in range and throwing big shots. Good combination. Hard leg kick from Garrett. Garrett starting to pick up the volume here in the second round. Good out. You, yeah. Those leg kicks are starting to get nasty. Yeah, and Garrett went to the calf with the second one. Into the calf on that side. Onama needs to find an answer for it. There's several answers. You just got to find one. Whether it's checking it, whether it's stepping into it, or whether it's answering with strikes. Good big knees to the head. And a punch on the break. Those leg kicks are going to add up. Another one. Armfield's finding a ton of success inside. Hey, Boom. big shots. Big punches from Onama. Boom, and a big one too. He's raining on him. A flurry of punches. Armfield still looks so composed in there. Yeah, doing a great job staying in his stance, keeping his weapons loaded, keeping his hands high, showing a lot of experience in there for only having six fights. Boom, and Emma hammer fist the thigh. Breaks, goes back to the center. Under a minute here in our second round. Nama's keeping him on the outside now and having some success. Thirty seconds left, round number two. A big leg kick from Garrett. Another leg kick. These are adding up. He's being accurate with him too. He's hitting the same spot. Another one. Forces Onama to switch stances. Well, like we said earlier, this stance switch is good offensively, but do they have it figured out defensively? 10 seconds left here in our second round between Armfield and Unama. Boom, big punches from Unama and a flurry to end the round. Garrett answers back with a big overhand and a big knee. They are scrapping, ladies and gentlemen. Both these guys look great so far. And, and this is the difference right here coming from a well-established team, well-established coaches. Both these guys are fighting out of great gyms. They've been in these, they, they, they've felt the feelings in the gym that they're feeling right now. They've been in good fights. Both of them look extremely composed in a very competitive fight. Yeah, this is a hard fight to score. You know, David is landing the bigger hands. Garrett keeps scoring with nice leg kicks over and over. Both guys exchange good body kicks. Let's go 50-50 on the body kicks. Let's give David the hands. Let's give Garrett the leg kicks. It's a tough one to score. Yeah. No takedowns, right? Uh, no takedowns so far. We will see how this one shakes out as we move into our third and final round. The 
see if the volume gets picked up from either of these two guys. Boom, both guys standing right outside of range looking to fire straight punches. Boom. Good left hand. Onama throwing back fists. Good head kick from Armfield. Boom. Onama's looking to... It he's looks picking like he's the volume up. Yeah, he's coming out with a purpose this round. David Onama is looking to call kick. the lead hand. Oh, oh big knee to the, the head. head. Big knee to the head. Big knees, a barrage of knees. That was a solid knee to the head. They work in the clinch here. Armfield's as tough as they come. Armfield comes out and answers with strikes of his own. No, oh, knee. a big, big knee. knee. A huge knee from Onama. That one hurt. Big knee from Onama. Yeah, it was hurt. <laughs> Armfield is tough as nails. He's still throwing in there. Just over a minute left in our third and final round for the featherweight title. Anama lands a big knee, big another knee. big knee. It's big a barrage knee. of knees. How tough is Garrett Armfield? Onama telling Garrett to bring it on. It looks like Onama is starting to bully him here. This could be the end of it. It was a volume change from David Unama here in this third round that has turned the tides. Oh, big one two from Unama from both stances. Good left hand. Ten seconds left here in our third round. Good knee from Armfield. And Unama just is taking it on now. Oh, a little after the bell. Big punch. A little after the bell. That was in the exchange. Yeah, they were both in the heat of the moment, exchanging big punches. Great fight. Yeah, awesome fight between both game competitors, both oh, yeah. guys. Absolutely. Garrett Armfield is as tough as they come. He ate some big knees in that third round and kept coming forward. Can't ask much more out of a title fight than what we just witnessed. How you scoring this one, Turner? I think Unama stole it there in the third. He picked up the volume substantially in that third. And as tough as Garrett Armfeld is, he, he just didn't seem to have an answer for that volume. Uh, I think Unama takes it 2-1, but as I always uh, say with the disclaimer, you know, when you put it in the judges' hands, anything can happen. Yeah, it seemed to be a really competitive fight in the first two rounds. And then the third round, I don't know if it was an attitude switch or maybe some fatigue or cardio. Ladies or and happened, gentlemen, we now go difference. to the judges' scorecards. All three judges have scored this bout 3-1.
30 to 27. For your winner, by unanimous decision, and now the KCFA Amateur Lightweight Champion out of the red corner, David Onama. David Onama. David Onama leaves with an undefeated record and a little bit of hardware.